Uh, Dave, according to the daily log, three aircon maintenance people will be working around here from 11am. Oh, OK. I'll keep an eye out. OK. Um, I'm going to make sure their work area is coned off and everyone knows. OK. Uh, can I stop smiling now? It's hurting my face. Yeah, mine too. Is sore face from smiling a safety issue? I don't know. You got the clipboard. You tell me. Health and safety at work is all about identifying and managing risk. So if you create a risk, you need to manage it and help get everyone home healthy and safe. Oh, well, morning boss. We've got a van load of roofing tiles being delivered today. Yeah, and I was thinking if we could get four helicopters to escort the van from the street to the site, you know, for safety's sake, so the blokes see it. What, four? You think there's too many? Not practical. We have about three helicopters, is that enough? Still too many. Two. The new health and safety laws aren't about demanding the impossible. But you need to be as practicable and reasonable as you can to prevent illness and injury. And to get your workers home healthy and safe. So you're all visiting from the design firm? How'd you guess? Well, it's a shoulder bag mainly. Right. Anyway, watch out for the wires hanging down. Like those up there? Yep, yep. Well, the sparkies are in today connecting them all. Uh, mind where you're walking, there's a few cone off areas coming up. So, I shouldn't be watching my iPad? That's right. But we aren't even moving. Responsible businesses look out for all their workers, customers and visiting suppliers. It all helps to get them home healthy and safe. Right, you see this here? Yep. That's the name of the bloke responsible for your safety around here. But that's my name. That's right. It's you. Oh, well that should be easy enough. Won't leave my own side for a second. Just have to make sure I'm rostered on with me every shift. Yeah, yeah, that'd help. Follow your workplace rules and procedures, and if you're not sure about anything, ask. Because we want your home healthy and safe. It's been making a strange whirring sound and then a sort of a boof boof ka-ching. Yeah, definitely shouldn't go boof boof ka-ching. It says here that there should be two more bolts holding that piece on while spotted. It's not safe like this. OK, well I'll switch it off and let maintenance know and raise it at the next health and safety meeting. Right, I'll come with you. OK, should we go? Yep. Let's go. OK. You're not moving. Neither are you. Yeah, I think we need a new photo. Safety is everyone's concern. If you see something that doesn't look right, call it. You could save your workmate's life and get them home healthy and safe. Look, you're the architect, right? Oh, what, do, do I look like I'm an architect? Um, you couldn't look more like an architect. Yeah, you're the archetype architect. So? So, you should come to morning tea. The boys have got some questions about the design. Oh, all right. Do you have double decaf lattes at that? Oh, sure, and tomorrow we're having canapes. Uh, canaps. Everyone who contributes to the design and build is responsible. From the window maker to the engineer, anyone who provides a service, imports a product or installs it, is responsible for it being healthy and safe to use. I'm suggesting the crane should go over there. Yeah, but the foreman just told me it was going behind us. Well, I'm only here to do maintenance, but isn't there a gas main there? If you're a contractor, a client or a visiting subby, your work will overlap with someone else's on site. As a group you have to work together to meet your health and safety responsibilities. Working together will help get everyone home healthy and safe. You, you can probably put your arm down mate. Put it down. 